In this video, I'm going to show you how to activate great runes and what to actually do with them when you defeat bosses. For the sake of this video, I'm going to use General Radan or Scar Scorch Radan as an example. So after you defeat him and most other story bosses in the game, you will get a great rune specific to them, right? And then you have to find Divine Towers immediately after. Like this one over here is the Divine Tower for General Radan. To show you this one in particular, all you have to do is take your horse and ride up to it. You'll see there is a branch. We are approaching from the higher side here. Jump at the branch. You'll see there's a guy with like a spear that's on fire. Climb the ladder after defeating him and you will see you will kind of follow this pathway upwards. So when you climb to the top of the ladder, you are going to the left over here. You can either jump or be smart and actually use torrent. I find the second part here, torrent works a lot better because I've missed so many of these jumps. And try face towards the wall when you jump so that you can rather like land them because there's a few times where I fell off and it sucks. So climb this ladder here and you will get to the site of grace at the top here. And then you can make your way to the right to go up the tower or the opposite way to go down the tower and kind of just explore down there. The top of the tower is where we headed. You will get to this giant lift, you just have to take the lift to the top. When you get to the top, this is what you're going to see, and this is where you activate the rune. So we're going to be activating Radon's rune by doing this over here, and this allows us to actually use it, finally, and actually put it or equip it onto our character. And you do this at a site of grace. So head over to one and go to Great Runes, and you can select which one you want to have active. Right now you can see I only have two of them because I actually only recently figured out how this actually works. But you can see the difference between these two is one greatly raises my maximum HP, whereas the other kind of raises maximum HP, FP, and stamina. I decided to use Radon's one instead. Now that is great and all, but however, it does not actually work immediately. It's not active. We're actually not using it. Even though we have equipped next to our health bar at the top of the screen, it doesn't work. It's not there. So when you actually want to try use one of these or activate it, you actually have to go to your inventory and use a rune arc. It grants the blessing of an equipped great rune upon its usage. I'm not even sure how long it actually lasts. Um, it seems to last quite a while. I recommend using it before boss fights or anything, but you can see here my stamina went up my FP went up as well as my health went up and if I had to use Margot's one instead I would have had a much bigger health bar instead of like the FP and the stamina increase. So I hope this video helped explain how to activate these great runes, what they do and you know like how to actually theoretically use them while you're in combat you know to actually make good work of it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching.